good morning students in today's class let us learn about learning disability you know that students find difficulty in learning the things so what is the difference between learning disability and learning problems in today's video let us be very clear with about learning disability and what are its types and how to eradicate them learning disability is a disability that affects a student's ability to understand organize retain and understand the verbal and the non informations non verbal informations given to them in the classroom you know students have different types of learning disabilities we can define disability as a physical or a mental condition that limits a person's movement or his activities this term was first described by samuel crick in 1962 learning disabilities or a type of neurological based processing problems neurological it is related with your nerves muscles and your sensory organs and it is a processing problem you find difficulty in processing the information which is given to you that's why learning disabilities affect the acquisition organization retention and understanding of the verbal and the non verbal information provided to a person learning disabilities cannot be cured or fixed which means that it is going to be a lifelong condition in the individual's life learning problems are not like the learning disabilities learning problems are primarily due to a result of a dis handicapped nature either they may have a visual hearing or a motor handicap or of an intellectual disability emotional disturbance or it is from the environment culture or due to some economic disadvantages in the life of the individual so normally you find children finding difficult to learn the things they might have some uh, visual problems hearing problems or they have some motor handicapness those are learning problems which can be rectified or you can provide some alternative measures to uh, overcome these problems but learning disabilities cannot be cured or fixed but you can reduce its impact generally people with learning disabilities will have average or above average intelligence they are not uh, intellectually weak okay so uh, learning disabled children are mostly of average or above average intelligence there are different types of learning disabilities and uh, the individual with the disability education act idea it is called as idea in the federal law it has enacted that there are 13 categories of specific learning disabilities which come under the general term of learning disability so learning disability is a very big umbrella term and it includes many different types of learning disabilities and the federal law has recognized some 13 categories of specific learning disabilities we can see in this picture the learning disabilities and its types dyslexia dyscalculia non verbal learning disorders central auditory processing disorder adhd dysgraphia language disorders auditory processing disorder sensory integration disorder and visual or uh, the visual motor deficit so these are the specific learning disabilities which come under the term of learning disability okay you can see here the classification and the types of learning disabilities 
normally we see any children based upon their academic performance isn't it so based upon their primary uh, attention perception and memory they have different types of disabilities and based upon the secondary thinking their oral language and solving the problems they, these disabilities can be divided and based upon their academic learning disability what they have academically doing in the classroom so uh, namely dyscalculia dysgraphia dyslexia dysphrasia and executive function so here is a very uh, clear classification about which are based on academic and the learning disabilities which are based on the development of the developmental norms okay so when you consider any child we can see that mostly we think that only the academic learning disabilities are given importance is it not so there are also some other developmental learning disabilities that occur in the deficient in their attention perception memory thinking and the way they solve the problem and their communication skills everything so let us see what are the main types of learning disabilities the three main types of learning disabilities are dyslexia which means a reading disability dysgraphia the writing disability and dyscalculia a difficulty in performing the basic mathematical calculations and the arithmetic calculations we can see dyslexia dyslexia is nothing but where any child find difficulty in reading so when you consider reading reading is not a uh, easy thing where you have to first you have to understand what you are learning you should know uh, how to remember the concepts you should find how to handle that particular situation where you will have uh, your pronunciation difficulty or your uh, spelling difficulty so many occurs in the system you can see here the dyslexia can be occur in a student due to all these difficulties that is either they may copy it difficult uh, they have a difficulty in copying the things in a right way their handwriting difficulties they have a coordination difficulty and they get lost easily about uh, from their memory they uh, find it difficult to recall the things and they find difficulty in getting ideas on the paper and so all these come under dyslexia and then dysgraphia they have uh, difficulty in writing the things is it not so they will have problems in writing the thing uh, their letter uh, formation is different their uh, holding of the pen or the pencil that is different for some children they don't remember the key words when they write they forget uh, to memorize the concepts so they are finding difficulty in writing it in a coordinated manner and then you can see here the final one dyscalculia that means they have difficulty in coordinating with the numbers basic plus minus and addition and all these things and they have a problem in transferring their information and they struggle hard to understand about uh, the basic ideology behind uh, the solving of the problems everything so if you want to overcome all these difficulties these difficulties can be it is very better that we identify the learning disabilities in early age so that its impact can be reduced but we cannot cure them fully it is going to be a lifelong condition in the individual's life dysphrasia where it is going to be a difficulty in coordinating the fine motor skills with their uh, hand eye coordination this is due to a sensory integration disorder they will be thinking something but uh, they can't make it in a uh, diagrammatic view or a writing view so that is going to be the dyspraxia so your assignment will be differentiate between a learning disability from a learning difficulty and write points about it okay thank you